I made pancakes. Jess, do you want a pancake? I'm not hungry. You've got to eat something. Will you just try one? I'm sorry. Are you okay? It's the bin men. It's the bin men. Look, here, I'll do it. No, 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 it's okay. Just get another one. Just get another one. It's fine. It's delicious. Hmm? Delicious. Oh, good. Glad you're enjoying it. Would you like another? No, I'm good. Mm. Oh, Jess, I just remembered I've got something for you. A dress. It's lovely, isn't it? Do you like it? Yeah. What's it for? I thought we could get all the family together and get dressed up and look nice and just have a... When? I haven't got any dates set yet. Well, don't lie to me. Like I said. <sighs> Why don't you try it on? If it doesn't fit, we can go into town. We can change it. Later. <sighs> just try it on. Look, I'll just do it later. It's just, there's a lot of books that I want to read, so can I just, just wait till I've got to the end of this chapter, yeah? This is all you've been doing for days? Well, there's a lot of things I want to experience, like reading books. There isn't a rush. We've got plenty of time. All I'm saying is... Mm. Well, I just... What do you think it is? Some kind of celebration? Of course not. It's just... It's just a gathering. Just, well, who are you trying to protect? I'm not trying to protect anybody. I'm just trying to make this easier for all of us. Pretending that it's not going to happen. <sighs> that we're not going to... Going to... Oh, just stop it, please. He's driving me mad. I'm sorry. I just don't know how to do this. There's nothing in the parenting books about any of this. I just, I just don't know where to go with it. Okay. Come on, I'm dying to see you in this dress. Um, I'm going to go to school. Well, what do you want to go to school for? It's finished, hasn't it? Well, just, I want to get out for a bit. Well, okay. Will there be anybody there? Well, yeah. I mean, it's today's the last day school's closing because they don't see the point. Oh. And, well, most people are turning up anyway now. And, well, I just want to go say bye. Okay, well, at least let me give you a lift in. No, no, I'm going to get Kara. Oh. I've got your pancake. Mum told me to. Um... crazy or something but if you look around everyone's doing it i stop at every noise or smell or pretty thing and take like a mental picture in my mind this bus is late we're gonna be late so i think it would really matter what you've never been late before this whole thing started why start now got a reputation to uphold i just don't see the point of it all really point of anything. Like, we've wasted our whole lives and and we've been lucky enough to have the days that we've had and to ha that we have the days that we've got. So we might as well spend the time enjoying them rather than being in a grump about something that's inevitable.
Not much. Uh, had a barbecue. Really? Yeah. And um, cow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, What's mine? Cow is just not survivable. Like, uh, if you uh, I don't know. It's just me on my own, to be honest, in the field. Just on my own. I'd like to make a toast. A toast to death. We're all going to die. <laughs> now, I may have known some of you a little bit better than I've known some of you others. But I'm glad I knew you all. I hope that the end is peaceful. I do have my theories of how it's going to end, but I don't want to bore you all with it. Oh, please, Harry, tell us a wise one. <laughs> all right, well, there's going to be monsters. Giant spiders that rise from the sea and devour us all. Yeah, I'm telling you, right? It's not going to be all this, oh, it's just going to end. Bull. <laughs> They're hiding something from us. You really think there'll be monsters? I'm just saying we can't rule it out. No, no, I think it'll be peaceful. Like, we'll all just go to sleep and then never wake up. Like, the atmosphere just disappears or something. But if the atmosphere disappears, that won't exactly be peaceful. People's heads are going to be exploding everywhere and we could suffocate to death. Well, I don't really like to think about it. Well, you can't not think about it. Surely you have an idea of what you think's going to happen. She thinks it won't happen. Her dad's got to convince it's some kind of government conspiracy. What? My mum's seen him. He just sits there and stares at the sun and notes down the air pressure and stuff. And he's got all these news, old newspapers and he's convinced the government are just trying to wipe us out or cause some mass hysteria like a Darren Brown show or something. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> think about this. Why would the government try and do all this if it wasn't actually going to happen? Do you really think they make this much fuss about it? Is it true, Jess? Does he really think it's a conspiracy? I... Um... Shut up, all of you! Leave her alone. Who cares what her dad thinks? Everyone's got their own theories and stuff and no one can say for sure what's true and what isn't. So everyone just shut up about it. Come on. So where have you been? What do you mean? Well. I feel like I haven't seen you in ages. Oh yeah, well my mum's wanting me to spend a lot of time in the family, so... Ah, I see. Is your mum not? Well, yeah, she has, but I just really don't like being there. Mm. It feels so abnormal being with them all the time. It's like a constant reminder that, well, you know, I, I hate it. Yeah, I know what you mean. Is it ready? You are? Just for being there, you know? Pretty much my whole life. <laughs> Don't get all wet on me now. No, but seriously, ever since I first met you and you pissed yourself in that sandpit. Well, that did not happen. You were sat there crying and well, from that moment on I'd, I knew we'd be friends. I did not wet myself. Trust me, there was a reason why I never set foot in that sandpit again. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> nah, but I just wanted to say thank you. Well, thank you too. Fancy some lunch? Oh, yeah. So, do you have any regrets? Can you not just let me enjoy my cake? But, dear. Oh. I'd wish, I wish I'd carried on singing. Singing? Yeah. Oh, come on, you must remember. No, I don't think I do. My mum forced me to be a choir boy. Were you even there to watch that time? Oh, my God, yes! <laughs> Hey, don't laugh, I was actually pretty good. They, they gave me the role of Oliver, but I turned it down because, well, the other lads were taking the mick. Said it were gay. Screw them. And that's what they thought I wanted to do. People are so... horrible. Hmm, yeah. So... Do you have any regrets? I guess... Living for the future. It's my biggest regret. Do you well, yeah, but it's true, isn't it? We're like programmed to what with school and stuff. And now our future's never going to happen, so we've completely wasted our time. We could have been seeing the world. We could have been doing anything. And we've been trapped. <laughs> Controlled.
How's your steak? Fine. Good. I thought I might have undercooked it. Let's see. It does look a little on the pink side. It's fine. You don't like it, do you? Look, give it back to me and I'll put it in a bit longer. It's fine. I thought perhaps we could all go out tomorrow. The weather's going to be lovely. I can't need to work. I thought you might want to, because this time next week we won't be able to. What do you mean? We've still got three months. You haven't heard. No. We've had letters. The air quality is depleting. It's no longer safe for us. The air is perfectly normal. Then why? Prisoners in our own home, that's what we'll be. We'll be trapped inside. Oh, they can't stop us. It's for our own good. I've run tests. Nothing has changed. You're wrong. How will we get food? The forces are taking care of it. They're making deliveries. Everything is going to be fine. No, it won't. Oh, please. Oh. It's all lies. For God's sake, Sarah, it's obvious. They're trying to hide something. Making people stay in their own houses. What's the point? We're all going to die anyway. Well, what would they be trying to hide? They're not trying to hide anything, Jess. Don't listen to him. He's not taking this very well. I'm... He's not very well. I know I'm right. Trust me, it isn't the earth that was a real danger. Who was it? It was some volunteers up and down the street handing these out. What is it? It's got our names on it. One for each of us. What does it do? It's designed to send you off peacefully. You decide whether you want to go pain free or not. So there's no decision in it, really, is there? Right. Surely everyone would choose that as the alternative. Of course, sweetheart. So do you think they're actually going to tell us what's going to happen? Because I'm so sick of being left out in the dark about it. No one understands it. Well, we're not exactly going to be top of the list, are we? I mean, they're just going to wipe everyone out and these people, whoever they are, they don't care. They're just, there's no reassurance, there's just nothing. Don't worry, Jasmine. We won't feel a thing. What? Yeah, but whatever their title, they've got to deal with it all too. Like, no one's safe from it. And in a way, that's a good thing, because them celebrities who think they're like royalty or something, they aren't immune to it. For the first time, everyone's equal. Yeah, but I bet they know. <sighs> Harry, what's wrong? What? Oh, God. None of you know. You know what? What's happened? It's, it's Kira. She's, oh God, yes, I'm so sorry. She's, she's dead. What? Her dad drove down a country lane. He took them all, a little brother and mum. He killed them all with carbon monoxide. The scenic bastard died too. All he left was a letter saying, saying he didn't want him to suffer. What kind of a scene? I think I'm going to go to bed. Jess, you haven't eaten all your tea. Your meals are okay. They're quite nice. I like them. It's not to do any cooking anymore. Just trying to eat some more.
I just don't feel very well. I think it's everybody else has it, but what we do. Always have a bad immune system in our family. Some paracetamol in the cupboard. Do you want a hot water bottle? She's fine. Well, she's obviously not, is she? It's psychological. It's in your head because they told you something's going to happen. Everyone thinks they're feeling symptoms when they're not. It's not. It's the air. <laughs> it's the climate. Oh, it's impossible. I've checked it every day. Nothing's changed for six months. Six months, Sarah! I couldn't even get out of bed the other day. You're telling me that's all in my head? What's your problem? Why are you trying to fight against it? For God's sake, Paul. This is hard enough as it is without you constantly pushing against it all. What are you so desperate to prove? You've missed your chance to become a superhero. Why haven't I got any symptoms then? Hmm? I haven't done anything differently. I'm living in exactly the same area as you. Well, I don't understand. You're lying. You're just convincing yourself that it's not happening and it's not true. But we need support. Think about Jess. What is wrong with you? Look at you. You're wasting away. You haven't slept in our bed for weeks and... This is the first time you've sat down at the table for a meal that I've prepared in God knows how long. Oh, and just be with us and support us for the little time we have left. Are you serious? Oh, for God's sake. Oh. Jess, leave it. Mum. It's fine. Jess. Damn it, connect. There's been no signal for weeks. What? There's terrifying toxin in Jess, the food. Jess, go upstairs. What? No. Jess, will you please go upstairs? You're not hiding things from me anymore. I'm sick of it. I have a right to know. I, I don't need to be protected. Fine, I'm oh, oh. Well, I'll explain it all. I used to work for the government. It was a long time ago, before you were even born. It was a covert government scheme to create a drug to help soldiers fight infections in the military. I discovered terrafin toxin. <laughs> all the tests were fine. The focus group, they, they all got ill in time and died. Before we could find a drug to reverse the effects. I got fired, the prototypes were taken away and I was glad. I thought that was the end of it. But they kept it. And now it's, it's in the food. Well, it's been developed a bit further since then. They've made it less condensed. So its uh, effects are less obvious, less noticeable. So now, Shouldn't we be taking the drugs that the government gave us before it would get any worse? Jesus Christ! Everything you've been told today is wrong. The world isn't going to end. They're just trying to wipe us all out. But... why? I don't, I don't know. I made antidotes. I worked on these after I was fired. I just needed to feel I could have helped. There are only prototypes, but they should work. There are only two. I, I, well, I, I haven't eaten much. I haven't eaten much of anything lately. I, I should be okay. But Dad. What if you're not... Hey, come on. I'll be fine, I promise. Now take your tablet. Both of you. I'm still not sure about this. I mean, the folks who said that they wouldn't drink that stuff before, before they had to. But this thing with the food, supposing... That's just to make sure that before the end, so we don't suffer. I'll prove it to you. 
We don't take that stuff at 11 like we're meant to, but we wait. We'll wait till morning. If it's as bad as they say it's going to be, then we'll take the stuff. I want to be sure. Hey, wake up! We're alive! I oh knew it was right! <laughs> I knew it! Oh what are you doing? You might not be safe yet. It's fine, honestly. Clean it as it's ever been. What was that? I don't know. What's going on?